Hey everyone, King 77 here from the Android Creative Syndicate team here to do a video showing you how to install the latest ACS recovery based off of Clockwork Mod 5 on your Samsung Epic 4G Touch. It's for the Epic 4G Touch. Um, I will do another video for the original Epic for all you original Epic owners. But anyways, this is based off of Clockwork Mod 5 and it will give you ACS recovery. I know it's definitely one of the most popular custom recoveries you have options to and it is based off the latest EK02 kernel but it will work regardless of your setup depending it doesn't matter if you're on EK02 EG30 it does not matter you can flash this regardless of your current setup on your phone uh, but anyways click on the link in the description of the video it takes you to the site huge huge thanks to Chris41G for doing this for us as you can see kernel clockwork mod Odin you actually have two options download links right there click on it right there open up the bunch of files. It's taking this time loading. As you can see, Chris 41G's hosting site. And you have two options whether you do want Clockwork Mod 5 or ACS Recover 5. I highly recommend ACS Recovery. So select that, and it should give you two options. You can either use Odin or Clockwork Mod, a previous version of Clockwork Mod to flash this kernel, or Odin. Odin, you download the tar and Clockwork Mod, you download the zip. In this case, I'm gonna show you how to do it with Odin, so in case you're on stock for any reason, this is how you do it. Or you can use Odin, or if you have Clockwork Mod, you can install the zip. So it's up to you, whichever method you wanna use. I'm showing how to do this, but uh, if you do wanna install it with Clockwork Mod, just flash that zip, no wipes necessary in Clockwork Mod. So download this tar file. It will look something like, let me go to my downloads folder. So it's gonna look like this, stock ACS EK02 tar.md5. So it's gonna look like that. And once you have that, you're good to go. You're gonna to need to open up Odin. I will post a download link to Odin if you don't have it. So go ahead and find Odin and then double click on it and hit yes. And once Odin opens up, all you have to do is press the PDA box right down there and then select the stock ACS EK02 tar. And that's it. And then make sure on this side, only auto reboots check. So uncheck F reset time and have only auto reboot check. So PDA box, you have ACS recovery in there and only auto reboot check, just like always. Otherwise go back to your Epic Touch and you're gonna need to boot into Odin mode to do so volume down and power button at the same time. Press and hold both of them. Keep it held down and should take you to this screen. Warning, custom OS can cause critical problems. Press volume up to continue and it takes you to download mode or Odin mode. So go ahead and plug in your Epic 4G Touch into your PC. Once it does get plugged in, you should see a COM and then a number. It doesn't matter what the number is, just should say COM. If you do have problems with Odin and recognize your phone or it's failing, re-download the files, try different cables, try different ports, and re you can try reinstalling drivers, which is Samsung keys. So it doesn't matter. You just make sure auto reboot's checked and ACS recovery is in the PDA box. Otherwise, if you have that yellow box, you're good to go. Just hit start. When you start it, you should get a progress bar going across. It shouldn't take too long. As you can see, it says kernel, and it jumped up really quick. So it shouldn't take long at all. As you can see, nine seconds should reboot my phone, and once it reboots, I'll be good to go. You will have this yellow triangle. I do have a video showing you how to get rid of your red, yellow triangle. Just search for it on YouTube. You'll find it or I'll post in the description of the video, one of the two. And otherwise, you can try a USB jig as well. I'll post those two videos, how to get rid of the yellow triangle with the jig and just in general, how to get rid of it. Otherwise, I'm gonna let this reboot, at, well, okay, it's rebooted. I'm gonna go ahead and, let me zoom out, power off my Epic Touch so I can show you guys the ACS recovery. It's very awesome, so definitely wanna check it out. So I'm gonna power it on off, and then I'm gonna go ahead and let it power off and then boot into ACS recovery. Okay, once your phone's powered off, you're gonna to need to go into Clockwork, well not Clockwork, ACS Recovery, which is based off of Clockwork Mod 5. So, volume up and power button to get into your custom recovery. Volume up and power button, press and hold. It does take a little while, so make sure you keep holding it down, don't let go. Just keep holding it down. And then, oh, I do wanna make a side note. If you install this kernel with Clockwork Mod, you will not have the yellow triangle, so keep that in mind. You're not gonna have the yellow triangle if you install it with Clockwork Mod, only if you do it with Odin. So here you go. As you can see, 
ACS Recovery 5, version 1.0.0.0, Clockwork Mod 5 based. And here we go, ACS Recovery, here's what it looks like. You got Reboot, Power Off, Wipe Data Factory, Reset, Wipe Cache, Install Zip, Backups and Restore, Mounts and Storage, and Advanced. So some cool features that this has is you can go to Install Zip from SD Card, select it, and you have Pre-Theme Install Wipe, Pre-ROM Install Wipe. These are the two main awesome things. What Pre-Theme Install Wipe does is it will wipe your cache and your Dalvik cache and then you can just install your theme and pre-ROM install wipe is going to wipe your data cache and Dalva cache so it's going to wipe everything uh, previously to installing a ROM so you'll be good to go when installing a ROM so just very awesome features having to do with this ACS recovery Chris 41G does a great job with it I know everyone on the Epic 4G loves it and it's going to come out for the Epic 4G the original Epic 4G so um, we'll have it on both the Epic 4G Touch as well as the Epic. So this is just really great recovery. Other than that, that's how you upgrade to it, whether you want to use Odin or Clockwork Mod. If you do run into any problems, have any questions, feel free to ask. Leave a comment on the video. I'll be happy to help you guys out. Be sure to subscribe for future videos, and thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up.